So, I decided to make the prefix comment. Okay guys, so what happened that I asked you in the server which uh, database you want me to make, mongoose or quake.db, so that's what I got. Okay, uh, quake.db is an actual database but is kinda local database, but it is easy to use. So Mongoose is a cloud database that allow you to uh, store your data, uh, like not on your PC, you know. So yeah, but the problem that Mongoose is much harder. So when I asked, I found out that most of you want the easiest way, but it's not the better way. So we choose quick.db. So yeah, let's start making that set prefix per server. Okay, so sorry for not uploading for about three th three days. I had exams and stuff. So yeah, first of all we need to delete this. Okay, and here go here and npm i quick dot db. Oh, be before quick dot db actually npm i python. Okay, after you do that, npm i quick dot db. That's all. To make sure that you got them. You'll go over here, sorry, here, here you'll find quick.db and python installed. So we need here to require the, what is called, quick.db, so we will do like this, and we type here quick.db. Now fine, we required it. Now let's go down to here. So we will need to make this like here and we will put gold like this, okay. So now let's actually delete this and make it like this, okay. And now let prefixes, okay, equal await db dot fetch oops fetch okay and let's do like prefix underscore message dot gold dot id okay I guess that's pretty easy so now we will make it if the okay so here we have blanket so here we say that we will let the prefixes be in like in the db it will be stored like prefix and gold id and then it, it, there will be the prefix uh, actual prefix one sec let me actually do like this okay so now if prefixes equal equal no that mean if there is no like prefix set we will do like this so, mm, prefix equal underscore so not underscore sorry equal so that mean that if there is no prefix set like no one did no one did uh, equal set prefix it will make it will choose this this will be the default okay I don't know if I type it right maybe like this default uh, prefix easy right so moving on to here else Okay, prefix equal prefixes. Okay, that's it. Now, let's go. Okay, by the way, you'll not find this. I will tell you how you'll get it. Don't worry. So, go to your config.json, you'll find the uh, 
prefixes, uh, sorry, prefix, just delete it and keep token, okay? So e there is a comma after token, just remove it so it, you don't get an error if you don't know. So let us go over here in the admin port and make a new file, name it set prefix.js. Okay, so now let's const discord equal require discord.js and then const db equal require web.db okay so now module dot exports dot run equal async and then let's do like client what client okay so messages message args prefix okay and then just an arrow function and then this so if no like if like if you made like this if and then exclamation mark and we type anything like message dot content dot starts with then prefix return that mean that if the message don't or no like exclamation mark mean no not like refusing okay so if the message don't start with the prefix okay don't uh, run it okay wait. starts like this okay so now if message not member not has permission administrator okay then return message dot reply you don't have permission to use this command so if the member don't have administrator permission it will make a reply you don't have permission to use this command okay so const let's do here so const new prefix equal args zero okay so what is args zero basically args zero okay that that's in my args system it is an easy arg system it is over here that's my arg system okay so let me go over here again zero is the thing that I type just right after the command so like if i type set prefix this will be args zero and this args one and the rest will be the same args two okay so if it if i type like uh maybe i don't know it's equal set prefix this so this will be args one arg zero sorry this here because it is the first thing after the pref uh, the command pretty easy right okay so now if new prefix new prefix if no new prefix like if he didn't mention new prefix return saying message dot reply please provide a new prefix okay so now if he actually set a new prefix so we'll make sure it is only like 
five characters, or I don't know, like five places like this. One, two, three, four, five. It, sh it can be numbers, it can be size, it can be letters, anything, okay? So, we will make sure it is under five, okay? So, no one can make it over five. So, return message dot channel dot send. Uh, this prefix is too long, okay? So now let's make it like here normal like message dot channel dot send okay so a new prefix set to and we'll make dollar sign those and we type new prefix Okay, and then we'll do like db dot set prefix uh, prefix underscore message dot gold dot id then a comma over here I guess yes then new prefix. So now in here we we are just setting the the new prefix in the database, okay? So now let me put here yeah, like this and okay, like that. Now let's test it out. When you node dot, you'll find that this file will be generated. You'll find it come from nowhere. Don't delete it, okay? It's fine. That's your database. It will, if you scrolled here, you'll find something at the end. But let me first test the command for you. So now let's go over here. So, let me do equal set prefix without saying anything else. Please provide a new prefix. So if I type pre equal set prefix, then more than five. So like one, two, three, four, five, six. This prefix is too long. Perfect. Equal set prefix to dollar sign. So now the new prefix is dollar sign. If I try to make equal set prefix again it will not work see the bot don't respond to it it will only respond to the new prefix okay so like this see so that was it for today's video i hope you enjoyed don't forget to like and to subscribe and to leave a comment down below what you want the next video to be that's it and ciao